My name is Dr. Amir. We all remember the sad moment last summer when we witnessed one of the Danish football players who collapsed and had a cardiac arrest during the game. Luckily, he made it after the great team efforts in reviving him by doing CPR, cardiopulmonary resuscitation. Please watch this video to help you learn the basic steps in doing CPR. It might help saving someone's life. The first step you need to do is to make sure that the victim is not responsive. You can tap on his shoulder and ask, are you okay? If he's not responsive, you need to ask someone near you to call the emergency number and to get a defibrillator, if available, which is an automatic device that can deliver an electric shock to the heart. The next step is to check if the victim is breathing by looking at the chest for rise and fall. At the same time, you need to check the presence of a pulse, especially in the neck, in this area. This should not take you more than 10 seconds. If the victim is not breathing and without pulse, then you should immediately begin doing CPR, starting with chest compressions. But you need to make sure that the victim is lying on a hard surface. First, locate the breastbone in the middle of the chest. Second, put the heel of one hand on the lower half of it. Then put the heel of your other hand on the top of the first hand. But try to keep your arms straight and vertical while doing the compressions. The most effective CPR is by giving about 100 to 120 compressions per minute and by pressing on the breastbone of about 5 cm down. After giving 30 compressions, you should stop to give two breaths through a plastic mask in order to avoid body fluids exposure. This mask should be sealed over the mouth and the noise when giving the breathing. You can hold the upper part with one hand while tilting the head backward. And the other hand should hold the lower part of the mask while lifting the jaw up, like this way. This is the best way to keep the airway open. These masks are found with paramedics or on the emergency cars which are available in malls, factories, or any big outlets. But in case they are not available, you can give mouth-to-mouth -mouth breathing only to a family members if needed. In this case, you need to close the nose with your thumb and index finger of one of your hands while tilting the head back and lift the chin up with your other hand. Next, you should seal your lips around the victim's mouth and give two breaths. You should continue giving 30 compressions followed by two breaths continuously until the paramedics arrive. At this time, they should use the defibrillator as soon as possible to deliver an electric shock if needed in order to correct the abnormal heart rhythm then transfer the patient to the hospital as soon as possible. I hope you enjoyed the topic today. Please share this video with your friends so they can learn how to perform CPR and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Until I see you again, I would like to wish you a happy, healthy life.